Surrender! You have no chance of escaping! Have nothing better to do? Got a couple MGs left. Yeah, man, I'll reserve it for you. Just shoot the eddies over. Triple the usual. Yeah, 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 yeah. They powder their noses with this shit up at the Crystal fucking Palace. Quality don't come cheap, Chum. Yeah, all right, preem. Okay, confirmed. Appreciate you rounding up. Nah, I'm at the other end of town, but I'll swing by as soon as I can. The hell is this freak tech?
Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive, at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Played a few of these myself back in our samurai days. Acts like that run as many eddies? Forget it. We couldn't afford it. That's Carrie's fave. I know that one. An oldie but a goodie. What's... Second Conflict. Carried always goes straight for kitsch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. Never fade away. Guess if I had a fave, it'd be that one. What's... Old single we put out. No idea why Carrie hoards shit like that. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. So much better. Now let's see which you're up for show and which are actually strummable. We lost everything. Keep playing. No. no. That is some fucking joke. Hang on. 
What did Silverhand tell me before he died? Visit test. Could just play you another song. Answer me. Told you to leave Samurai. Go your own way. Clearly I was right, as I often am. Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh fucking contraire! Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Not looking all bad yourself, either. Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. You need a drink? All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? This is V. You'd like him. The fuck, Johnny? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. Sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just popped by to shit all over my life, well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Oh, it is a heartbreaker. Oh, fuck! Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Stuff about you being depressed. It's true. Nope. Promo stratagem. Suicide attempts, too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me, got no answer to that. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play and never had Ned do our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart in that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Who's that? Luis, the ex-wife. The what? Huh, <laughs> you're kidding. How long did it last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry. It worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo. Cars. Kids. Yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too then. It's 
still in touch with the gang? Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Bess Isis, damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. Henry probably killed his own liver. That nah, would have hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. A few calls and I should be able to track him down. Denny might still be in the biz. Actually had talent. And the spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do one gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened, all this. Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. We'll just say you're my new input. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Hmm, I'm not there, figure it out with V. Sure, uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. Johnny, you okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. What the hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Gets sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the Rogue thing? One big letdown. Nah, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay, calling Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice. Nancy? Uh, I mean, uh, Bess? Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News, how can I help? Want to talk to Bess? She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. If anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better head to the Totentons.
beautiful butterfly Carrie emerging from his silky samurai Christmas. Probably the only actual necessity in this whole pad. Feel like shit too? Nah, need a power nap. Wanna join me? Let's go, V. He's joking. Give him that one.
protocols starting to come together. No media would ever go for the Taunton tents. Except Nancy. Like your style. Minimalist. Used to have chrome just like that. Start moving. Totem tens too? Fuck yeah. Third floor. H press the button. <laughs> well, my fingers are numb. Come on, up you go. Today, all right, guys. This one I like. Go on, you'll blend in, no problem. Sir. 
they're, they're maintaining drinks. You began alone this time, huh? No punk ass amigo today? One more word about him, and I stamp you out like a roach. Got it? Got it. Feels like I know this guy. Why? Pretty loud in here. You renovating? Ha ha! Good thing Royce can't hear you. Tinnitus, apple of his eye. Royce, eye. Ha ha! You a fan of your little gang group too? Well, more a fan of the classic. Samurai and all that. Like this guy already. Just not a word to Royce, hey? Where'd you get your chompers done? Ah, oh, shit! Forgot you ain't seen these buttes yet. You know the before, now you see the after. What do you think? Want the same? Twinsies? Nah, you look gonk as fuck. Looking for Bats Isis, N54 News. Know she's here. She is, but she's busy talking to Royce. He told me not to bother him. Oh, I'll do the bothering. Lead the way. Come on, then. Royce remembered me fondly? Dunno. Hasn't mentioned you. Royce and Bess getting on all right? Well, she ain't too bright. Royce is being real fucking patient with her. How'd you get him to agree to talk? I don't think anyone ever asked him about the music. Not serious, like. And Royce likes being taken serious. <laughs> A couple of questions. So you think you got all you need? You wanted half an hour of my time, we're on day three. That's Nancy, all right. Change things up a bit. We're for a cruise on the Ebunike the other day. You're turf, right? Yeah, my people gave you a tour of the docks. Seems a little busy. Might want to think about a better system than an old Athena 3. <laughs> Already pissing me off. What's worse, he might be right. And have you pegged for a music geek. But you know everything else about me, right? Maybe one more question from Bess. Why does Tinnitus only play the Totem Dance? <laughs> only place they get the right audience. The snob's the last thing I'd ever expect you to be. Cochlear implants. That's what tinnitus plays on. So each of you is an instrument. Does that mean an element of mysticism? Supposed to be one question. Got some biz with Bez. I don't know him. Carry uridine, Sandy. Ah, uridine, of course. Uh, where would you put him on the musical map? You know what happens when you filter all the pulp and shit out of juice? Gets clean, smooth, soft. Flies off the shelves in Corpo supermarkets. And what's it look like? Piss. That's what. That's about where I'd put rocker boy music. Now get the fuck out, both of you. Wasted enough time. Come on. We'll scan you the way out. Uh, give us a minute. Get out of here in one piece. Doesn't seem to me like you're in any danger. Gang seems... Really 
sign enough to warrant you. Because they haven't seen all I got. And they'll check all the files on our way out. If they find anything they don't like, which they will, they'll wipe everything. Me included. All right, you gotta get her out of this. You came here to do a music fluff piece. I did, but then I stumbled on something bigger. What exactly? Stay tuned to N54 News to find out. You gotta help me get out of here. How'd you plan to get out of this before I showed up? Ah, uh, I'd have thought of something. Pretty good at improvising. Might have tossed someone out a window again. Hey, why are you just standing there? Let me copy the data and get it out. They'll want to scan you too. Not as dumb as they look. Not about to do anything to draw any notice. Okay, here. Delete yours, then try and distract them. I'll sneak out. Okay, try the window. Guy's bathroom. <laughs> Classic. Then circle around the back. There's a sort of balcony there. I'll meet you by the elevator. On my way out. Go ahead. Scan my stuff. All right, sit down. Someone come by. You gotta be kidding me. I thought that was Would your you job. Would you look at that? She planned it all out. Had time, knows the place. Had practice, too. Most of our gig she left via the window. Had to. Wipe everything. Me included. All right, you gotta get her out of this. You came here to do it. That's your planning. Let me copy the data and get it out. They'll want to scan you too. Not as dumb as they look. Not about to do anything to draw any notice. Okay, here. Yours, then try and distract them. Yeah. I'll sneak out. Okay, try the window, guy's bathroom. <laughs> Classic. Then circle around the back. There's a sort of balcony there. I'll meet you by the elevator. On my way out. Go ahead, scan my stuff. All right, sit down. Someone come by. You gotta be kidding me. I thought that was Would your Would you look at that? She planned it all out. Had time, knows. Had practice, too. Most of our gigs she left via the window. Had to. Well, I could. Algus. Algus? Seriously? No way. Not about to let him poke through my files. Roy said he made Algus your guy. How's he supposed to know which files are okay? All willy nilly just so as not to displease his daddy. For fuck's sake, chill. I'm gonna blow. So if it ain't Al, and it ain't gonna be me, then who? Uh. Grimy. Den Den. Views to die for.
Let's find that elevator. Stuff. All right, sit down. So we'll come by. You gotta be kidding me. I thought that was your Would you job. Look at that. She planned it all out. Had time, knows the place. Had practice, too. Most of our gigs she left via the window. Had to. Well, I could, but Algus. Algus? Seriously? No way. Not about to let him poke through my files. Roy said he made Algoth your guide. How's he supposed to know which files are okay and which aren't? He'll trash them all willy-nilly just so as not to displease his daddy. Fuck's sake, chill! So if it ain't Algoth, and it ain't gonna be me, then who? Uh, Seppo? Why him? Never talk to him! Uh, kind eyes. Good guy. Interesting haunt, this totem dance. Old factory, isn't it? Uh-huh. What, no mood to small talk? You need something? Or are you gonna keep fucking around? I'll take a drink. Don't know you. Likewise. But hey, I can live with it. For now. But you try anything you shouldn't. I'll smash your skull against the wall. Got it? All clear. So... Formalities all settled. Can we get the biz? Uh huh. Well, you have.
Take a drink.
Oh, you're here. Fuck. Why is elevator so damn slow? Got my car downstairs. Got everything? Yep. Send you the files in a sec. Wonder how that other thing's going. Carrie, Henry, and Denny. You still in touch with anyone besides Carrie? Any... who? Huh. Now she's an actress, too. Come on. Car's just outside the entrance. Was asking about Samurai. How old are you, kid? That's ancient history. Nobody gives a shit about samurai these days. Believe me, I'd know. Once in a while, news slows to a trickle, so I try to push through some nonsense about Silverhand. Where's Johnny? What actually happened in Arasaka Tower?
Oh, for fuck's sake! Could have been worse. This way you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Conquer like this. Hope it gets us there. One piece. All right. So what's Carrie want? Wants to bring back samurai. One gig, one night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. I'll play for Johnny. <laughs> you. Let's just say Silverhand was more visionary than musician. I got this. Trust me. Well, if you got Carrie on board, what's in it for me? Believe I just saved your ass and your precious story. Mean to ask, how do you know Royce? Biz, some time ago. Fascinating son of a bitch, isn't he? We're here. Hop out. All right, so, the concert? <sighs> Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Be in touch. Okay, thanks. Went pretty damn well. Now call Carrie. Be in touch. She agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Managed to contact Henry or Danny? Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. Henry didn't know. Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? Gonna play with us, aren't you? you? Gotta meet the others. Send you the address.
see those. Ooh, what happened here? She must have been renovating. Henry must have borrowed the truck. Gonk always was good at improvising. Maybe they're home. Try the intercom. Right then. Guess we keep looking. Carrie beat us here. You fucking god! Who boy? Danny, what? Sounds sadly familiar. What are you doing here? This is really your house? This is your Me. fucking pool? Uh, good you're here. We got a problem. We're gonna pay for this, you Piece of shit! You bet I will! Just so I can come back again! Maybe then, you'll tell me why the hell you left me to die in the street! Left you to die? Ugh, I wish you would fucking die! Why am I even standing here talking to you? Get the fuck out! Is this your backup? In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Carrie sent me. It's about the concert. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? Look, it's awkward. Carrie considers you both friends. What a sensitive guy. Shit. Given he's the one who set this flaming turd bag on my doorstep. We'll bring it back samurai. One night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet, but no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny! No, no way. Either him or me. Choose. Danny digs in her heels. We're done. How's it going? Like shit, man! Danny wants me out of the gig! And we already agreed on everything! What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. It's all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn. Don't make me choose. Got Maybe if someone would tell me what happened. Are you blind? Fucker filled my pool with cement. Maybe he had a good reason. Really? A reason? Gotta go without one or the other. Uh, yeah, not a problem. Should be able to borrow someone else for one gig. Won't be the same, though. It won't ever be the same, Carrie. Pretty sure it's your call. Fuck really pisses me off. Denny's on a control kick, setting conditions. On the other hand, Henry's got scop for brains. Can't trust him. Thanks. Real helpful. Got some on your mind, V? V? Help me out with this, please. Ugh, if we gotta choose, let's play with Danny. Fuck, Carrie! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me! Listen, I'll get you. You know what, Carrie? Fuck you! Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. You done? Get out. All right, what about Nancy? We made contact. She's gonna set it all up and let us know. See you at the show. Fuck. Now I gotta find someone to clean this up. Okay, about all we can do for now. 
Except wait for Nancy to call. Everything okay? No. Just the sight of that douche wad reminded me how not okay it is. Don't worry, though. I'll be past it by showtime. Wonder what Henry did to her. So his fault after all. Well, normally, Denny's not a raging bitch. We're pretty sure she knew Henry wanted this concert. Hmm, doubt she really gave a fuck about the pool. Sorry it played out like that.
me fuel now? I pay for the premium package. Can you? <laughs> oh, you should. Just please be aware of the children here. They do tend to steal. Uh, whoa! Cat's never gonna believe I was actually here. Got any advice about cyberspace? Venture out as often as you can. If you know where to look, it can be beautiful. Cyberspace beautiful. It's a collection of data. With many varied and wonderful isles. Jungles, mountain valleys, coral reefs. Old simulacra nestled on uber-powerful servers. One gets a glimpse of what the world once looked like. I don't know. Seems like bunk. Been to cyberspace. Nothing special. Minor pixelated nightmare, really. If you and me were to enter the net right now, it'd tune into our mindsets offer two different visuals. But some sites out there, fantastic corners. Look the same to us all. Finding those, that's my thing. Can I see what you got?
You heard what Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. Chew, fuck off! Or I implant my blade in your ribs! Really think you're fast enough for that blade? Really? The way I see it, be a smoking hole in your chest before your neurons even light up. But hey, nothing like a little experiment, right? Hey, right, come on, Pedro. That works. That works out. Yo, fuck you! Carajo! Fucking punk! Well, what... what just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why... why'd you help me? Because you would've caught a beating. Or worse. This fucking town, these people? Just here, minding my own business. If it weren't for you, I'd... Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh, bartender got the rest. Look who it is. Anything interesting happening in the area? Interesting. Around here? <laughs> Not one single thing. That's why the kids, they join gangs. No jobs. No future. Where they end up? Behind bars. This neighborhood died a long time ago. How do you feel? How am I supposed to feel? Hi. I'm sorry, Dee. 
I shouldn't have. I... It's just... When I see him that day, in that limo, all covered in blood, you know what I wanted to say to him. Te metiste en una gran problema, Jackie Wells. As if he was 14 years old again. Just coming home from a fight with the other kids. He's like... My brain was trying to protect me. But I always was afraid what happened. It's okay, Mama Wells. I... I can't talk about this now. Okay? Did you ever talk to Misty in the end? I did like you said. I invited her over for dinner. And... So skinny. Who would have thought? I know what she looks like. That's not what I'm asking. Hmm. She's a little bit uh, eccentrica. Said my home sits on a natural energy source. But I think I know why, Jack. She's a nice girl. We exchange numbers. I'll have a drink. Ahí viene. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, me. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you, then? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, right? Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or, I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smoke's like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Wait. Well, Today, she was wearing a pink jacket, and uh, she had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night, she wasn't even there. Size that? Well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there's a way around every test now. Why you wanna know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gun question is that? Simple one, answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife, breaking up a happy marriage. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. Means a lot to me. CD Bar's betrayal of beguiling woman sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints. 
But now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story. An unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. You about done. I'm trying to focus. Not her, I thought. No pink jacket, no guilt in her eyes. Christ, this is even worse than your songs. They say all dames are the same, but this one, she was different. You having fun there? her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. Dreaming of the day, the narrator put a fucking plug in it. Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know. around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. Keep this up. I'm a fucking puke. Narrate that. is a bum. Gives him a wide berth. Doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. Oh, seriously, what what did I ever do to you? Be careful! 
sure nobody followed you. Husband sent me. Suspected something. What? See who's Wait. right. No! It's... it's not like that. I... I can explain. Go on then, let's hear it. Okay, for, for one thing, he's not my input. He's my ripper. A specialist in plastic surgery. A specialist in this dump. Look, I know, I... I had this little accident a few years ago. The victim, uh, Well, the patient's family still can't let it go. That's why I'm forced to work here. Hold on a sec, uh, what about your kid? Here's the thing, I... Oh, I didn't used to look like this. I had a total body sculpt. Skin, hair, eyes, everything. Except, well, you can't fool your genes. That's why our son looks different than Pepe imagined. It's not because he's not the father, just that I, I don't look anything like the old me. But why? Why do that? And why do you think? Out of boredom, because I was a rich, basic bitch? Everyone's got their own secret. Something they want to forget or leave behind them. I... I had a lot of them. And I can't share them with anyone. Not even my own husband. I know I should have told Pepe about all this, but... There was never a good time, and... And now that I'm expecting again, it... Oh, it... it, it wasn't... Please, uh, tell him, tell him that... Yes? I don't know. I don't know what to tell him myself. That, that I'm really sorry. That life's an absurdist drama, okay? Just, just go. Hit the nail on the head with that last point. Job's done. Followed your wife. Went into some rundown pad. Man was waiting for her inside. I knew it. What else? Knew it, huh? Didn't know a thing. Didn't cheat on you. At least, not in the way you think. Huh? What way, then? She was at a ripper's getting a scan. Her skin, hair, eyes... It's all implanted. Every single last part of her. So, my son. That's why he. 
Exactly. Jesus fucking Cristo. How could you keep this from me? Our own husband, ten fucking years. It's not about the skin or whatever, it's that she lied. How the hell am I supposed to trust her now? Okay, yes, Cynthia was hiding something from you. Yes, she lied, but the woman loves you, you gonk. You know how much that means in this fucking town? If I were you, I'd just live and let live, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I guess you're right. Anyway, thanks. This is for you. For your troubles. Good man, Pepe. Take care. Silence fell like a wet blanket over the city, muffling its cries. Time to rest, I thought. Time to drink. See? That's more like it. Finally making some sense.
You really saved my ass. I can't thank you enough. What about the ride? You gonna fence it? Well, I have to sooner or later. Know a guy in Sacramento, a collector? He'll set me up for life. Oh, but for now, I'm taking her with me. Spruce her up a little more. Wouldn't stick around too long if I were you. Six Street are gonna be searching high and low for this beauty. I'm leaving town today. It's like Uncle Estevez always said. If you gotta choose between your ride and saving someone else's ass, always choose the ride. At least you know that a ride's never gonna betray you. People, on the other hand, ¡Qué pinche jueguito es este! ¡Al carajo! <risa> Me hace... Solo me juzga la 
huesuda! What's the latest buzz? Static. How old do you know, Jackie? That was a good joke. You used to drop by for a while or two. But then, <laughs> tough guy exterior don't make crack after criminal dress. Big dreams in my head. The world's already poorer with you. holding up. Physically, never better. On a feed from morning to midnight. Got all these practices fucked Mentally. It's hard to say. It's not like she keeps it written on her face for all to see. He's a drink.
in it. Uh, seriously, they said it on TV.
all set up super sweet like tonight at the red dirt talk to Carrie didn't change his mind or anything no no not at all he's pretty stoked in fact haven't seen him like this since the silver hand days what about Henry still not on board <sighs> didn't even try not wasting my breath on that dick tip well so see you tonight and don't worry about your axe got the gear all rounded up I'm not afraid of anyone, you know? No one. This job. Sometimes it's hurry up and wait.
Hey, V. V. Got something for you. Don't know if you know, but once upon a time, this was Silverhands. Fuck, Nancy just gets shit done. She just whisper Mikoshi in her ear. We'll be all set. How about you tell me what happened with Henry? Ancient history. Kept falling into all sorts of crap, then I'd have to dig him out. You got tired of getting your hands dirty all the time. All wrong. Managed to get him a gig with a decent band. Henry quit using, got his shit together. Things were going great, so he booted me out of his life. What happened next? You get off on this sort of drama? He ditched me, partied with his new pals for a month. Then they tossed him out because he started acting up again. Ran into him on the street, total mess. Gonk even fainted for effect, a tug at my heartstrings. What did you do? Left him right there and made damn sure he couldn't find me again. How you feeling, the head of the show? Weird, like I'm about to pretend to be myself. Plus, Johnny's out. Never thought I'd say I missed the bastard, but I damn well do. Hey, thanks for putting the gig together. Please. Carrie couldn't twiddle his own asshole without my help. Silverhand was probably the same. Huh, worse. At least Carrie did what I told him to do, kept out of my hair. Where's Carrie? Should be here any minute. Told me you play really well. Better be true, because there won't be a dress rehearsal. Right. Can't let that full house down. Honestly, got no idea who these people are. Just strays. Carrie didn't want word to get around. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. You think the media caught wind of this? For sure. Hyenas. I'd worry more about Henry's replacement. Carrie got Drowson from Cutthroat to join us. I know him. Seen him play. And? He any good. He's fine. Just fine. You're the mystery dish here. Pill time. Just be discreet. And if I start puking blood again? Don't go making a scene. This is Carrie's big nut. Got a feeling Nancy doesn't think I can keep up with them. Well... She's right. Orale, esa mesa es de los calles 6. I know. Pero podrían aparecer en cualquier momento. Sure hope so. I like them bad boys. Ah, estás casada. Yeah. Nobody's perfect. This isn't such a good idea. Now you mention it? It's getting worse. Maybe this gig isn't worth it. Fine, go out and play. I'll just sit back, tend to my bleeding ears. Okay. Fine. You got it.
Let's motor. There you are. This is Drowson from Cutthroat. Hey, big fan, huge fan. You too? Got all their albums? I mean, I never Chill, dreamed of He's in the same boat as you. Want to talk to a star? Talk to me. And get that shake and under control. I think my shakes are the same. Or worse. Crowd got you stressed, or is it me? Fuck you. And miss you too. All right, let's do this. fucked up. What is? Actually, got pretty nervous for this thing. Felt like I had something to prove. To myself, to you, and whoever the fuck. But all I did was have a good time. That's it. Want to do it again? Huh? No. That was enough. In that case, here. Take it. As a souvenir. You sure? Won't play without you. Just wouldn't be the same. I see what you're doing here. But I still plan on playing. Yeah. 
Yeah, but he can still hear you. Thanks, but not in the mood for hovering tables and voices from beyond the grave right now. Maybe you should hang on to this, actually. Uh, how's the gig? Hellaprim. <laughs> Samurai's found its new growth. Damn shame I had to miss it. Nah, you can still come to my show. You shouldn't have, really. The very gun I tried to shoot Johnny with when he broke into my house. Meaning you tried to shoot me. Yeah. And earlier... And... never mind. Cool. Feel like I fell asleep and woke up 50 years later. Back to work, then. Take care, V. I'll be in touch. Well, it wasn't so bad, was it? Too bad care's gone off. Guess he had somewhere to be. Badly. Probably writing a new song as we speak. <laughs> Isn't that what you wanted? To make him feel better? Better, but not that good. Johnny, don't ever leave me again. I can't live without you. A little of that could go a long way. Hope that's it for last requests. Maybe. Now you get a chance to do what you will. Gotta go talk to Hanako. Fast. Okay. Your choice. Let's go. ¿Llegaste hace poco? Fuck I mean, country. shit, never heard anything like it. And you're not likely to again. Well, I do all right. Mm-hmm. Too damn well. Got me wondering where Carrie's been hiding you all this time. Is sick. Isn't this where Samurai played his first gig? Ah, oh, what a night. There's still legends about it. The music was so loud they had to replace all the windows. They made a new rule refusing service to new customers. There's a special on the menu just for Samurai fans. Ribs a la Silverhand. Pricey, sure, but you won't stop licking your fingers. Wanna have a look at your menu? Yeehaw! Right away, partner!
Yeah, I do. I don't know what you told him, but thanks. Thank you so much. Just wanted to catch up. The former? 
found your job posting about Swedenborg Riviera on the net. Oh, that. Wow. I completely forgot about that whole thing. So, um, is it, uh, is it still going? I mean, I still want to scroll a segment about it, so if you can find anything at all on Swedenborg, I'll pay you back in black caviar and champagne. But I doubt you'll find anything new. What have you managed to dig up so far? Short story? Fuck off. And the long story? Well, it looks like Swedenborg Riviera isn't just a radical philosopher and economist, but a damn good netrunner, too. Jack of all trades. Could you tell me more? I could, but... It'd be a waste of your time. I'm telling you, the guy's a ghost. I can't hurt to try, right? Well, aren't you just bursting with a can-do attitude? Have it your way, then. I started looking into all this about a year ago, right after one of Swedenborg's followers lopped a Molotov into the Helvetia branch. Tried finding some way to reach the guy, came up blank. Total brick wall. Hired a private eye, also came up with squat. May I be linked to the account? He would have used uh, cloaking demons, but there's always a mark, a trace. Well, well, I didn't know I was dealing with such a pro here. Guess what? I tried that. I managed to pinpoint the SIG to Santo Domingo, but linking it to any specific address was a non-starter. Districts jam-packed with units, as I'm sure you know. Ask some locals if anyone saw or heard anything, cash in hand. Zilch. Nada. Dried up all my leads. Got it. Listen, send me the coordinates of the last data term that relayed the signal, okay? I'll take a look. Worst case, I'll lose an hour of my life. Best case, well, who knows? Hey, if you're offering, why not? But seriously, V, I wouldn't get my hopes up. Happy hunting.
fault but yours. Fuck you. Why this obsession with Sweden, fuck? Hoping once you find him, he'll spill the meaning of life? Here, I'll save you the trouble. Life makes no sense. With you in my head, agreed. Now, how about some quiet time? I can't think. You stopped thinking long before I got here. But sure, blame it all on the guy in your head. Wait, 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 shh, shh. I need to look around. Pirate router. Think this is our Swedes doing? Only one way to find out. Sig's a match with what Nancy was tracking. And goes further, out to the Badlands. Like a server proxy. Don't tell me that's where we're heading. Why shouldn't we? Because this is all one big waste of time. The fuck do you care about a Borg fucking Swede? He rubs out sayings like a randy teenager and the whole world's guzzling it up. The three branches of government is a lobotomy on the people's autonomy. I mean, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, I, I get what's going on here. You're jealous. Jealous? About this shit, Swede? You out of your fucking mind? Mm -hmm. Cause he's the one all the anarchists and fist bumpers are quoting. 
while you played in piss-soaked dives for a bunch of stoned zit faces. Don't talk shit about what you don't know. Happy fucking trails. Years again. Sounds like this Swedenborg really values his privacy. Oh, thought you were done talking to me. I was, but it's not like I got anyone else to talk to. 
I'd go through your memories, but I don't want to puke all over your hippocampus. Well, hack away or whatever it is you were gonna do. Please, something happened. Got a feeling someone's messing with you, V. You'll follow this breadcrumb trail, and when you connect the dots, all you'll see is a dick. We'll see. Come on.
place finally. Look, get far enough from the smell, even Night City can be beautiful. Let me guess, another router? My dick theory starting to seem like a real possibility. Signal leads to another place? Yep. Hey, maybe this is all part of Swedenborg's message. Life is movement. Fuck the destination. It's how you get there that counts. Well, there's some truth to that. Jesus, V, this is philosophy for the hoi polloi. Have you ever read a book in your life? You know what? Don't answer. I don't want to know. So where's this next lead get us? A yoga class? A Tibetan monastery? No, to, uh... To an amusement park. Oh. The plot thickens. 